Oh man. It's bleeding. Well, it's gonna come out. Let's see. Come here. Oh, move your finger. Don't. Oh wow, that is so loose. Here, okay, let me wiggle my, it. Look at my tunnel. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Family with the lint a lot and gingerific. And yes, of course, their kids are terrific. With Giggles, Buster, to Loopy Doo. Here on YouTube, just for you. It's time for Fam Family. <laughs> Let me see yours. You got a milk mustache and a nice haircut. I like your haircut. Look at this. I got a tunnel. Hey, cut. You got a what? I got, I got, I got a tunnel. You got a tunnel? Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> did you like getting your hair cut? Yeah. You did. I know how to come on. How you were screaming tunnel? and freaking out then? Like you were screaming like a girl. Like a wild banshee. No, I was screaming like a cat. Like a baby. You were screaming like a baby? Yeah. You were. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You, yeah, you were, you crazy. What'd you just do? I pulled out my <laughs> second tooth. Let me see your mouth. Oh, it's so bloody. Sweet. Let's see your tooth right in your hand. Did you just do it all by yourself? Uh huh. Nice work. Whoa. Good job, pal. Did you guys pull out your own teeth? I totally did. I used to push them in and out. Yeah, that was hardcore. Did you pull your own teeth? Hmm? Did you pull your own teeth? Yeah, I pulled my own teeth. Uh, I pulled the tooth out once that wasn't supposed to come out. I used a pair of pliers. <laughs> I went in the bathroom, I got a pair of needle nose pliers and I rolled, I put toilet paper in it and I had a tooth coming in up high and I just grabbed it and, oh, and I had like tears and snot. I was like, oh. You know, like when you get bit in the face, it makes your eyes water. Yeah. I stand on there at the mirror. Oh, pulled my own tooth out. That's so funny. Yeah, that's more hardcore than me. You win. Kyle, where are we going? We're going in the zombie. In the zombie? Yeah. No, where are we going? We're going in the zombie. We're going to the museum. We're going in the zombie. Can you say to the museum? The museum. 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 Good job. <laughs> Good job. We're gonna go to the museum. Are you guys excited to go? I can't wait to see the dinosaurs. Hey, put bones. your chest strap on your seatbelt, Luker. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I can't wait to see the dinosaur bones. I don't know if there is any dinosaur bones, but I'm sure there's like horse bones if and was, cow if bones. There, if there was um hey, dad. a dinosaur bone out of fruit probably freak out because they're so Maybe, I don't know. I don't think they have that many dinosaur bones. They might. They, they don't, don't have a dinosaur. I think there's stuff like Native American artifacts that they found and pots and then there's, I don't know. I don't know. Well, I've never been there. Horses by meteors. <laughs> what? Horses are extinct. No. <laughs> Why don't we just go and let the museum teach us? Mm -hmm. Right? I, well, I know one thing. They, I can they, go. they don't know what the real color of the dinosaur is. That's true. They don't know the skin pigmentation. They can guess, but, but because of other lizards and stuff, but they don't really know for sure, huh? Uh huh. What, what, if, they were, what if they were uh, magenta? What if they were like neon pink running around? <gasps> That'd be weird. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so either. We're at the Idaho Museum of Natural History, not unnatural history. We're not looking at aliens and weird stuff today. We're, we're going to be looking at buffalo bones, I think. Uh, don't fall, Bluey. <laughs> <laughs> right? We got to make it as fun as possible, That's right? right? Look at he's practicing. Okay, that. turn around. Come on, little rock monkey. Oh, look, the moose is eating his head. That's a buffalo. Or <laughs> Go, mom. Ginger's not an anthropologist <laughs> or a biologist of any kind. Okay, turn around and wave. Go like this. Yay! Gage has got it. Turn around, Luker, stand up. Tulipi, turn around and look at that. 
Daddy. Look at me. No. Yay! Taloopy. Say hi. Kyle, stop and say, go like this. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Good enough. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, be careful. Yes, Good job. I don't think there's any caveman, but we'll see. If there was, I'm going I'm to run away. Up here in this building, Dr. Jeff Meldrum has the world's largest collection of Bigfoot Which footprint building? castings. I think in this one. Oh, cool. Should we go see if he's in his office? The original Patterson-Gimlin footprints are in here. Isn't that crazy? They were so close, I can almost touch them. <laughs> maybe someday I will. You will. Oh, maybe someday I will. Yeah. When they take animals and they stuff it with other things and it. Like other animals and stuff. <laughs> Cotton. Does that freak you out at all? No. Come here. Those are ravens. The black? The black? Crazy. I don't know if I've ever seen one in real life. I mean, a raven? Well, yeah, and like in the wild in Idaho. You haven't? I don't think so. You always see them flying around the cemeteries. <laughs> what is this? Oh, what is that? They must do little educational stuff in here. An orca whale. Orca whale? Looks like a killer whale. Oh. That's cool. Oh. Is this pretty cool, Kyle? Come here. Okay. Look at that. What? Look at that. Yeah. That's a black bear skull, and that's a human skull. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Gage, come look at this. This is a velociraptor foot. Pretty crazy, huh? Yeah, I wonder how if that, that is. If, if that claw can... got you, man, you would, you would die. You'd, you'd be dead meat, huh? Cold Why weather, <laughs> cold weather survival. This place is actually pretty big. I had no idea it was this big. That's very cool. Hmm. Yeah. Very cool. Protoceratops. Oh. Wouldn't it be fun, Ginger, if you could have pets like that? I know, right? Little protoceratops running that's around. That's right. <laughs> Look how big that skull is. I wonder how big that is. I wonder how much feet that is. I wish I could just go there. Oh, that thing's like five feet tall from the nose to the crest up there. I wish I could go touch the teeth. Not supposed to touch, though, huh? It's very crazy looking. Become a scientist? You're gonna be lucky you get to touch all of them. Yeah, the, the human ones. Anyways. Yeah. It's a geode. These are kinds of arrow tips. Arrowheads, yeah. Those are pretty cool looking, huh? Can you believe? They just take a big rock. Come here. They just take a chunk of rock like that, mm -hmm. and then they use it, take another rock, and they go chip, 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 chip until it gets really thin. Look how tiny some of those are. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. That would take a lot of work, and then you'd and then you'd get your get your bow and arrow like that, and you'd have to sneak around out in the forest and try to shoot a deer. And if you missed and it broke, you'd be in big trouble, huh? And be hungry. Oh, that freaks me out. That freaks you out? Yeah. It's like a troll face, huh? Yeah. Look at those teeth. Look at those. I can see them, yeah. Do you use that to scare? Look, there's, <laughs> there's one with a long nose back in there, too. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at Here's a tail. Could be a lot worse, huh? Could be making dinner in that every night. Can you imagine? Well, if it was already made, that would be okay, but having to make it. Well, they're so like make it. they're like getting their corn and putting it down in there and pulverizing it to make their tortillas and stuff, okay. or whatever they make. Could you imagine now oh, having look. to hollow that out? Chicha recipe right there. <laughs> That's what they chicha. were. Chicha. Chicha barrel. That's crazy. Yeah, they pound their corn in there. That's crazy. Big hand carved canoe. I love stuff like this. This stuff is just fascinating to me. It's so cool. It's amazing to 
think that people actually lived lived like this. Like, look at that. Look at all the. Look at how they used to have to make their stuff. They just get a piece of basalt and find another rock, and over time it gets all. These are like their kitchen utensils, you know. That's just awesome. Juniper seed, and they just like grind it up, make their meal out of it, make paste. <laughs> so cool. Did you know that mo at one time the whole western coast and even half of Idaho was under the ocean? I didn't know that. Check out this little map. If you look at the lines, I know I've got a shadow there. Look right in that box there. Oh, come on, focus. Autofocus sucks. Anyway, if I hold still, you can see the little lines right in that box there. You can see that's Idaho. That's the panhandle of Idaho right there. This all along there is like the Sawtooth and Rocky Mountains going up. Everything to the west of that's all California, Oregon, and Washington's all under the ocean. That's pretty crazy. I had no idea. Idaho underwater. So there's your black bear skull. There's your grizzly bear skull. There's your short-faced bear skull. And there's your short-faced bear. <laughs> it's huge. It's, a sh it's called a short face bear. Short face? Yeah. It's more like a long body bear. It's huge, huh? Yeah, it's like a, I should have been in a dinosaur. These things used to wander around here in Idaho back during the Ice Age. It did? Uh-huh. It's pretty crazy, huh? Grizzly bear. Yeah. Look at, this, look at the size difference between a grizzly and a short face bear. Man, the animals used to be so huge back then. Look at that. So you know when you go to Yellowstone National Park and they tell you don't go try to feed the <laughs> buffalo? Because That's why. Because <laughs> they, the they could destroy the you. That's scary. That's the the I know. The humongous bison. They look like... Well, it is. It's called the giant bison. They don't have to call it the humongous bison. It's called the giant bison. If that stepped on you, you're dead meat. If it got you with its big horns, look at that. Everybody thinks they're like really nice, big, docile cows, but... Come here, little cutie pie. That thing would destroy you so fast. That's crazy. And there's the saber-toothed cats, that's cool. Yeah. They're having a fight, see? Yeah, it looks like they're getting ready to attack the buffalo. Do a dance, you can do it. <laughs> That's cool, they have like a whole little play area for kids here at the museum. Whoa, dude. Put on a, put on a chicken one. Okay. <laughs> You guys are so in rhythm. I like your your squatting hunchback technique. Dude, look. See that ancient thing right there? That box, that big receptacle? That thing's called the Garbajo Pithecus. Ancient garbage from the from the Trashiolithic era. Did you know that? That's pretty cool, huh? Just kidding. This is a garbage can. <laughs>